Uh, yes, hello. So I'm, I'm just putting this video up as a sort of video evidence to, to settle a dispute with uh, a friend of mine, Daryl, down at the, uh, the Wagga Bowling Club. Uh, I won't get into it too much, but uh, the other day we were playing and uh, he, he uh, someone said they described someone as the Bradman of Bowls. And I said, oh, like David Bright. And uh, Daryl said, what are you talking about? And I said, uh, I, I could remember that uh, David Bright, uh, uh, I remember him playing a, a game with when he was partnering uh, Tony Alcock in Paris, and I remembered, uh, I remembered it because Tony Alcock smoked a pipe, and uh, I used to smoke a pipe in those days as well. So I'd remembered that, and uh, and I remembered the commentator referring to David Bryant as uh, the Bradman of Bowls. And anyway, I spoke to Daryl about this, and there was a big kerfuffle. And I just thought I'd, uh, I found this video on an old tape of mine that I had at home. And uh, I've got my grandson to convert it over to the, to the, uh, uh, the video. I'm not sure how, how he does it. I gave him the tape. I had an old tape at home. And, and so hopefully he's going to put these this together for me and and prove that uh, David uh, Bryant was used used to be known as the Bradman of Bowls and uh, speaking of pipes I would like uh, Daryl to put that in his pipe and uh, and smoke it but I'm not sure whether I don't think he ever smoked pipe so but you understand the expression okay here it is um david bryant the bradman a bowls not just good drawing and driving but those good controlled weight shots as well that was a perfect ball it is said of that man on the right of your picture now on the left that he is the bradman of bowls the bradman of bowls and that perhaps is the highest compliment anybody can be paid. 